For me, New York is fast, brash, and loud. It has non-stop energy, huge personalities, and every neighborhood feels like you're in a completely different world. So you gotta move fast to get it all in. So book your trip to New York and let's go. So if you're coming to visit the city, there are three golden rules. You gotta eat good food, you gotta catch an awesome view, and you've gotta have a great night out. I love starting off a packed day at my go-to neighborhood spot, Chalfanar. The French toast, omelets, and sticky buns are the best in the East Village. And even better, the owner McCoy wears a different crazy hat every day. What else do you need? New York City is full of characters, so it's always fun to meet locals over a game of ping pong in Tompkins Square Park. But these are not your average amateur players. Stick around here long enough and you'll see world-renowned stars battling for park glory. So, we're going to Williamsburg. I was 31 years old when I bought my first piece of furniture, and since then, creating the ultimate interior space has become a die-hard obsession of mine. So if you're like me, you'll love Beam. The team scours the globe to find the best in homewares, and they have new shipments every week so you never know what you'll find. Back in the city, Miss Louisa is a colorful, vibrant, and modern approach to Jamaican cooking. It's perfect if you're looking for an upbeat spot before you head out for the evening, plus they're famous for their jerk chicken. Van Leeuwen's ice cream is made from scratch with ingredients you can actually pronounce. And if you're a vegan, they have options for you as well. They started as an ice cream truck and are now a mini ice cream empire. I love ice cream. I don't drink, so I'm always looking for creative non-alcoholic drink options. The drugstore creates custom sodas like matcha tonic and rose lemonade. Plus, they taste great. Very good. My friends and I are obsessed with karaoke, and if you're gonna do karaoke in the city, you've gotta to go to Koreatown, and if you're gonna to go to Koreatown, you've gotta to go to the spot. Book a private room, pack it with your friends, and I always say, what you lack in talent, make up for in enthusiasm. You know, there's always something new to discover here in New York, and if you move as fast as the city, you'll have no trouble packing it all into one day.